Hello everyone, it's Myla. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be going over um, my Birdies Making Sense uh, haul that I did. She is a new vendor to me. Um, I have had her wax in like G-Stash, but this is like the first time that I've purchased from her. Um, I just want to mention, I, am, I had to refilm this video again because the first one that I did... Um, it didn't come out well. Uh, there was like an issue with the mic and, um, yeah, so I'm refilming this again, but, um, I really wanted to share birdies, um, and what I picked up and, um, what made me go into the website, um, number one is I've been kind of going on her website here and there because there's this blend called Hannah's baby that really caught my eye and everybody talks about Hannah's baby. So I was like, I'm going to grab that. But the first order that I did was back like the end of January. And, um, she was having like a, a big sale, like on her Christmas items. And, um, I would, they were like 50% off. And I was like, this is a good time to take advantage of it. And then I paid, I, um, placed another order in March. So, um, the beginning of March because I have like two invoices here so <laughs> and um I, another thing I realized too is that I picked up like uh doubles of certain scents that I didn't realize I picked up doubles of but which is totally fine and I'll share that as I go here but um let's get into this and uh let's get started I hope you are all doing well um I just got home from work and I'm like, let's smell some wax. So I wanted to mention this was the paper um, that it was that was on top of the box. So I had a rainbow one and um, a pink one. And she had these, um, like she put this nice little um, bag in here and it has, there was actually two bags because I had two boxes, but I got rid of the other bag. So here's her business card and Bridget's the owner. It's called birdiesmakingsense.com. And what I like about birdies is I like the aesthetic. I like the, um, how it's like food themed and not just food themed, but she does like other shapes too. Um, and then on the back here, it says, um, Bridget is the owner and the creator and um, snack desserts and food theme handmade scented wax melts. And it says, my S-H-I-T stinks. So I like that. <laughs> um, I'm going to put that back. She puts a beautiful, like, thank you in there. And I absolutely love that. And then on the back of it, it says, when you support a small business, you're supporting a dream. Your purchase made my day. I hope you, I hope this package brightens yours. I really appreciate your support. So really nice, right? Very, very nice. Um, and then there's some stickers in here. So there's a little smiley face, um, a pizza. <laughs> um, we have Donkey from Shrek. <laughs> and um, that squirrel from that movie. Uh, is it the, you know, it's like a dinosaur movie. Um, I can't think of the name of it, but. I like that squirrel. Um, and let me see. And she also, oh wait, here's one more. And it says, imagination, imagination rules the world. So there's another sticker too. Really nice. So I wanted to share that. Um, she threw in two size uh, samples in here. Um, the first one is strawberry twisted cookie, which is Sugar twist, sugar strawberry cookies and twisted cookie. So I thought that was really, really nice. It's a nice strawberry blend, but I wonder what that twisted cookie is. Like, I feel like I'm getting like a white chocolate in there. Or maybe it's a smokiness. I feel like it's like a strawberry, like white chocolate. It kind of reminds me of like strawberry quick. That's what's kind of coming to my mind with that but very different and I appreciate this sample it's a very nice size sample I mean very very nice thank you very much Bridget and then the other one here is uh, sugared lemon zest cotton candy and, and marshmallow fluff which is um, very nice here 
nice lemon. It's lemon zest, which kind of reminds me of lemon curd a little bit, but it's a little toned down because you have cotton candy and marshmallow fluff in there. So this is nice. It'd be nice for my kitchen or um, summertime. So I look forward to trying that out. And I just want to say I appreciate the samples. So thank you, Bridget. So I will move that to the side. I have my invoices here. She did throw in this card. It's a big paragraph here. Um, thank you for your purchase. Has a little information about my wax. My wax has been reformulated and is Paris soy blended with uh, wax. It's a ratio of approximately 52% soy and 48% paraffin. You get the best of both worlds, smooth and creamy appearance and a great scent throw. I include melt after date on the labels. Please be sure to wait to melt your wax till after that date for best performance. Um, and then it talks about if you would like a smooth cut, pop it in the microwave for 30 seconds or less. And um, uh, it talks about the cotton balls too. Uh, place two to three cotton balls in your wax warmers while the wax is hot to drain it. Um, and then it says, I feel my wax performs best with a hot plate warmer. Bulb warmers also work well. You can use a tea light warmer and as well for best results. I find hot plate warmers work best. And I agree with her on that. Um, hot plate warmers do work very, very well. Um, wax performs differently in every household. Sometimes you have to test with different warmers to see what wax, what works best in your home. And then it says, if you have any questions, let her know. So um, very nice, right? Nice little uh, card there. <clears throat> okay, so um, I did pick up some and i started packing it back up because i don't know when i was going to get to it so it was packaged in like this type of bubble um wrap which i thought was really nice so this one was um 50 off let me see if i can find it uh so this is yeah so this um this was $3.70, which I thought was a really good deal. And it's Make It Rain. And it is um, Snickerdoodle, Gingerbread, and Cinnamon Buns. And this is a nice cinnamon. Um, I believe there's, yeah, gingerbread in here. This is strong. But it's not a spicy cinnamon because you got Snickerdoodle. This is really pretty. And I wanted to share the little um, reindeer. Like how adorable is this? It's so pretty. And then you got the glitter there and the reindeer. It's a nice size too. Really, really nice. So um, I will move this to my Christmas pile. <clears throat> and that's what I started to do. I started to, you know, uh, package some of it up, move something toward like Christmas. And um, yeah, so I started to do that. <laughs> Uh, I have another gingerbread blend. It's gingerbread sugar cookie and ro sugar cookie royale and zucchini bread. And I think this one was, I mean, really good deals. I, I was very um, happy about this sale. I was like, yes. <laughs> uh, I think it's the price on here. So it was $4.99. So it was 50% off. So um, it was $2.50. So. And I hear really good things about her zucchini bread, and um, I think I might have mentioned Hannah's baby, which I have in there, and I will go over. So this is the walking bread, <laughs> and um, it's cute little gingerbread. It's beautiful, yummy gingerbread sugar cookie royale and zucchini. And then I was on my um, gingerbread kit too when I was purchasing all this, so. I think I have enough gingerbread to last me a little while. So this is the walking bread. Very, very nice. Okay, let me see if I can move that. We'll put it away after. Okay. <laughs> Things on the floor. Um, so this is another uh, Christmas blend. This was from, uh, this is called, it's Snow, it's, it's snow Joke. Um, it says, is that say LD, uh, fashion eggnog, LD fashion eggnog and peppermint milkshake. And, um, here's the label. Am I saying that right? 
it is a peppermint with um, eggnog and it's really really nice you get two of these type of brittles but this brittle has a snowman on it a melted snowman mm. and I wonder what the LD stands for LD fashion and eggnog it smells like eggnog and peppermint it's pretty and um, I will move this to my uh, peppermint bin but really cute right really nice um, I like her uh, aesthetic, her attention to detail. It's different. This is very different and in a good way, though. So, um, yeah, it's no joke. <laughs> so I will move that one there. Actually, I'll just leave that there. Um, and then I have this one here, which is another. Let me see. I bought it on this one. Uh, this was um, $7.90, and this was 50% off, so it was $3.94. But this is the North Pole type, and it's a sweet peppermint stick with a creamy, rich vanilla foundation. So I just wanted to share that. But this is heavy. Um, this is so good because it's peppermint and vanilla and it's I mean I don't have to wait till Christmas to melt this or anything like that because I I melt peppermint all year round but look how pretty that is it's like a work of art it's like a nice vanilla um peppermint but not too strong with the peppermint it's very very nice so but it's like you don't want to cut into that right it's so cute so I wanted to share that and um this and i believe this was probably some um over uh like a sale from her christmas uh blends so i didn't mind i was like yay sale <laughs> i love when wax is on sale it's like you can't resist really so that's north pole type very happy to have that um i'm gonna go over some of these coffee blends this is Gingerbread Cafe Cubano, Brown Sugar, and Pound Cake. And I think these went for a really good price. $1.90 these were on sale for. So, and me with coffee. It's gingerbread with coffee, but the Cubano isn't too strong. If you have brown sugar in there, too, in the background, which is really nice. So yeah a nice coffee blend from uh birdies and that's uh gingerbread cafe cubano brown sugar and pound cake so i look forward to eventually melting these the other coffee blend that i have here and this one is really cute um this is roasted coffee and peanut butter cookies nice snap bar and these were on sale for a dollar 90 so Love when wax is on sale, and especially like on D Stash too, like when you're <laughs> on that D Stash site on Facebook. And people are like getting rid of wax because, um, you know, they're not melting it anymore or they're just, you know, don't want it. And they like mark it down super cheap. I love that. So this is a very strong coffee blend, but it's really good because it has peanut butter cookies and I don't have anything with peanut butter cookies um that peanut butter cookies goes well with that coffee is what I'm trying to say but it's so it's a beautiful strong coffee but there's like chickens and um chickens or turkeys on there <laughs> I think it's supposed to be a turkey but I guess it could be a chicken right <laughs> uh so yeah that's roasted coffee peanut butter cookies Mm, this is a really good, um, strong coffee blend, stronger than the Cubano. So, but so I got two snap bars of that, and um, this one is uh, lemon poppy seed, blueberry cobbler, and sugar cookie royale, and it's really nice lemons in there. And this one I believe went for. It's on this one here. Um, 
Okay, orange. No, that's not orange. Um, lemons. So these were. This was eight dollars, but this is very heavy. I wonder if it talks about the ounces on here. But did I show the blend? Here it is. Um, so you get these really cute lemons, and I love um, like blueberry with lemon or a blackberry with lemon. So um, I just wanted to share this lemon because it has like the like the pores from the um from the uh like you know like an orange or a lemon would have this is really good lemon poppy seed blueberry cobbler and sugar cookie royale mm, a really good um bright from the lemon but then you have that blueberry in there so yeah i, I wanted to give this a try a nice uh bakery fruity blend <laughs> really good and i think if you like lemon you would like this all right so i picked up that blend um and then i didn't realize this i ended up picking up two of these from uh <laughs> birdies and like when i was going over this i was like wow i should really check my um my my first order before ordering a, another order and you know <laughs> not realizing that i ordered uh one in one box and another in another and and another uh blend and am i saying that right i ordered i ordered two without even knowing it is what i'm trying to say spit it out my love <laughs> So this is um, jaw ready for this blue sugar cotton candy beach nights and marshmallow, and I don't mind having two of these because I love blue sugar lately and I love beach nights, um, and yeah, I was like this is gonna be good, and it is. <laughs> this is a beautiful blue sugar, and I feel like it has a little bit of mass, like a masculine note, and then you have the beach nights blend in there. This is so pretty. I have a like new love for uh, blue sugar lately. I've been, um, I just ordered the blue sugar sampler from L3 too. Um, yeah, I've been liking it a lot and I love it mixed with pink sugar too. So this is um, jaw ready for this and it's a cute little, I don't know if I took it out, it's a shock and I will share the shock. Eh, I think he's stuck. Oh. Trying to pull them out. Okay, here he is. Cute, right? So, okay, that is um, jaw ready for this. I'll fix that in a moment. Okay, so I ended up with two of those without even knowing it. <laughs> and I ended up with two of these too. <laughs> So this is, um, I'm, co I'm constantly hungry, blackberry jam, butter cookies, honey butter rolls, and cornbread. And I saw the blend and I was like, yay, this is so beautiful. Um, it's blackberry butter jam cookies. Cornbread is in there, but there's a honey butter in there too. And I've been liking that lately, but I like the pieces of corn on the cob. You get three of them. This is the smaller one. So... I just wanted to share that. So this is called I'm Constantly Hungry. It smells really good. This is very rich, um, like buttery, honey. And then you've got blackberry jam butter cookies in there. So I look forward to eventually giving this a try. So that's this blend here. All right. I'm going to put that in there for now. Okay. This is, uh, oh, okay. So this is, um, I can't see my forehead. Bubblegum cotton candy and a hint of Fruit Loops. And here, it's, there's the label. And then there's Patrick. <laughs> oh, I love this. Super sweet. It's bubblegum. I'm definitely getting bubblegum. And like Fruit Loops, what else is in there? 
cotton candy. All that sweetness. Um, yeah, really nice. I like that. She's very talented. Very, very talented. And then um, there's the back of it. Yeah, very, very nice. I also noticed she was doing a um, fundraiser for Sassy Girl Aroma, which I thought was really nice. Um, I think she was selling some type of t-shirts and, um, so much of the proceeds were going toward, uh, Sassy Girl. So I thought that was very nice of her to do that. So, um, all right. This is, uh, an orange blend and this is, can you peel the love tonight? <laughs> orange dreamsicle, beach nights and marshmallows. And you got three oranges in here. Like super cute, right? I love that. So it's very bright. It's a bright orange scent. Um, I get a hint of beach nights in the background, but that can change on warm. I've had like blackberry with beach nights, strawberry with beach nights, blueberry with beach nights. I've never had like orange with beach nights, but Really, let me just show this. <laughs> um, it's a cute little orange. Really nice. I like that. And you get three of them in here. Yeah. Really good into Beach Night. Beach Nights blends. Beach Nights. Beach Night blends lately. So look forward to trying that one out eventually too. Um, that right away. Okay. This one is really cute. Um... This is Whatever Tickles Your Pickle, Key Lime Pie, Salty Sea Air, and Shaker of Salt. But here's the label, and here is the pickles, but it's like a pickle in the jar type of thing. <laughs> so I really, really like that. That's really adorable. And you get a bunch of pickles in here. Mm. So it's Key Lime Pie, Salty Sea Air, I just want to share that pickle. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's different types of pickles. There's that pickle. And, um, ugh, I didn't realize that. And then you get the regular size pickle too. So that is so cute. This reminds me of that margarita scent or blend, I should say. It's key lime pie. So you get the key lime, the salty sea air, and then it says salt shaker which really reminds me of that margarita um, blend. But nice, this would be great for summer or spring. Um, I like those key lime blends in the, um, especially in like the, the spring and summer. So really any time, but it's got salty sea air. So just trying to put that back up here. And then I like the, <laughs> The, the jar of pickles. <laughs> so cute. Really nice. Really, really nice. Okay. This was um, left over from, I think this was from the first order. So this is the Fight, fight the Fight Red Velvet Cake Homemade Cookies Cream Cheese Frosting. And this was on, this is very heavy, by the way. I'm looking for my invoice. Let's see if I can pull that out. Um, I think it's on here. So this was originally $8.40, and it, um, it was on sale for $4.20. And this is big and heavy. This is like a rich, like, vanilla sugar cookie. You get the buttercream frosting. It has red velvet cake, but I've never had red velvet cake and wax before. But I just want to share that. Like, there's my palm. I have a big palm, too. So this is very big, and it's like, yeah, I would say it's probably about the size of my palm or bigger. So there it is. And I like the boxing gloves. Very rich. It's like a, it's like a vanilla um cookie but you're getting cream cheese frosting in there and I love cream cheese frosting I'd like to see how the red velvet cake plays on this because I again I've never had um a red velvet cake so great deal really really great deal um is this the right thing it was in I don't know if it was but you know what let's just put that to the side right now 
let's get through this. <laughs> and then I realized I picked up two of these and I realized that after, but I'm happy to have these. These are absolutely stunning. Um, this is Thorny Situation and it's Love Spell Ooey Gooey Marshmallow Strawberry Pound Cake and Pink Sugar. And I love Love Spell. I think I might have mentioned that in one of my last videos. Especially in wax. I don't like the Love Spell. Like, let me take that back. There are some Love Spell, um, like flankers from Victoria's Secret that I really, really like. But the original Love Spell, um, in wax, I really, really like it. Especially blended with strawberry pound cake, pink sugar. So, on cold, it's coming off like a, just a love spell, but this is so pretty. Like I love to melt this in wax probably more than wearing it as body care, but I still wear it once in a while as body care. Two toned, really pretty, right? With that rose, pretty, really pretty. So I ended up with two of those. <laughs> I was shaking my head a lot in the last video because I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't realize I did that. And I think when I was purchasing the second box of, of wax from Birdies, oh, my hair. Um, I think I was like, I couldn't sleep in the middle of the night and um, I had like a cart going and I was just like, and I must have just hit check out. <laughs> I'm like, I should probably check next time. <laughs> All right. So going back to this one here. So this one, I don't even know. I if I can show this one, but it says woman make it hard for no reason. I'm going to just show the sticker and then I'm just going to show that. I'm not going to take it out of the bag. Okay. <laughs> and it's a beautiful strawberry pound cake with sugar cookie royale. Oh, I love strawberry pound cake with sugar cookie royale or with cupcakes at Tiffany's. So I wanted to try her strawberry pound cake out. And then um, this one I was very impressed with. This is called Don't Be Lippy. Raspberry custard tart, raspberry jam donut, and beach nights marshmallow. Yeah. And I have to take this out because of the lips. <laughs> uh, this is pretty. Um, I was going to see if it, if it leaned a little floral the sometimes raspberries kind of have a floral note to them but check out the lips and the lines in there like it looks so real it says kiss on there like that's really pretty right it's a pretty raspberry it leans body care with the beach nights in there but i i don't have raspberry and beach nights i have strawberry beach nights blueberry beach nights blackberry beach nights so i wanted to give us this a try and that is called don't be lippy okay I'll move that, that back. okay put that one back just help myself what i'm doing here okay i'm gonna go into these brittles um did i just hit my mic and i got two of these brittle bars um these were on sale for 9.99 i got them for five dollars so this is break me this is just a break me bar and it's called having a mental bake down yep milk and sugar caramelized pie crust and i like the colors they're absolutely stunning beautiful fabulous it's um this one's a little light um i'm mostly getting like the sweet like milk and sugar um, there's caramelized pie crust in there. Mostly like on cold, I'm getting just the milk and sugar, but I would like to see how this comes out on warm. Um, I'll probably let this one cure a little bit longer, but, um, I mean, I'm not getting any like caramel in it, but it's, it smells nice. It's milk and sugar caramelized pie crust. Maybe a little hint of the pie crust is in there, but Okay. Moving on, I have Whisk Taker, Old Fashioned Eggnog, Buttery Gingerbread, and Sugar Cookie Dough. Nice little bar. And like, what a good deal. 
they were five dollars like for a brittle like this is great so eggnog gingerbread and sugar cookie dough yeah this is gonna go on my christmas um uh pile because i love gingerbread and then you have eggnog and sugar cookie dough this is blended so well and i like the brittle bar too so happy to have that and thank you for the beautiful sale um let me move that aside <laughs> come on get back inside all right i'm running out of room okay I have a few more because um, I think some are some doubles. Yes. Um, <clears throat> I wanted to try out her zucchini blend. These were a great deal. This is um, it's the most wonderful time for a beer, uh, butter beer and zucchini bread. And you get two of these um, brittles in there. So there's two of those. Mm, this is a good zucchini blend. Hold on. Show if I can find it. Um, I think this one was really, this was such a good deal. This was on sale for $1.65. Oh, snap me bars. Yep. I believe $1.65. Am I looking at the right one? Yeah, so I got um, two of these. So, yeah, $1.65 for these. I just want to make sure I'm looking at it properly. So my desk is a mess. Yeah, I believe they were $3.30, and then um, they were marked down to $1.65. Yep. Oh, wait. No, I'm sorry. $5.20, and then they were 50% off, and they were $2.60. Like, still, really good deal. So this is, like, butter, zucchini, um, maybe a little bit of beer in there. But it's like a buttery zucchini, and I love zucchini bread. So I had to get two of these, and because of the sale, I was like, yeah, I'm going to grab two. So, yeah, so I picked up two of, uh, it's the most wonderful time for a beer. <laughs> okay. Put that one back. And I picked up two of these. Yeah, no. But they're beautiful. And this is um, strawberry peach champagne and it's Let Your Dreams Blossom. Really pretty. So I bought one for one box and then the other box. I'm like, wait, I didn't even realize I ordered another one. But this is a beautiful strawberry and peach. And I like, ooh, I don't want to mess with my flower. It's a beautiful flower, isn't it? She's very talented. This peach and the strawberry. Mm, so good and that champagne note oh, it's so good and I like champagne notes especially in wax so that is let your dreams blossom so I ended up with two of those <laughs> all good um okay and then I have I think I have two more okay yep because I realized I picked another um, so this one too, I picked up two of, which I realized when I went through my other box. <laughs> um, and it's these really pretty, this is blueberry collar and crusty bread. And you get a bunch of these little brittles. Like, I just want to show that, like the colors in there are really, really nice. And this is good. It's blueberry and like a bready note. I love it. This blueberry cobbler is so good, especially with that bready note. Like, this is so good. Um, happy to have two of these because I love blueberry and, and I like bready notes. So it's like a nice blueberry bread is what it smells like. And you have sugar cookie royale in that, which makes it even a lot better. So I picked up two of those. <laughs> And this one I knew I picked up two of because this is the reason why I went in on the second box because the whole Hannah's baby. And I wanted to keep it in this because it protects it. So 
Um, especially that I don't know when I'm going to get to it. So I want to keep it protected. So this is, um, this is actually a jewelry, jewelry wax belt. And it's Hannah's Baby, which is strawberry white cake zucchini bread. And I've heard really good things about this blend. And um, I've already mentioned that this is why, this was pretty much the reason why I went in for that second box. <laughs> but um, yeah, had to try this. But there's jewelry in these um, um, pretty zucchini. I'm trying to see if I get the strawberry white cake, which is in there. But this zucchini bread is good. I'm looking forward to trying her zucchini out. Yes, it's in cheese, piece of cheese. <laughs> and there's earrings in here. Like, isn't that adorable? Oh my gosh, it's so good. Wow. Yes, happy to have it. So I picked up two of them and it says, please use caution if you cut into wax melt, you may cut into jewelry. So I look forward to eventually melting this and seeing what type of earrings are in here. What a neat idea, really neat idea. So I'm happy to have some Hannah's Baby in my collection because I've been eyeing it for a little while. So um, so that is my birdies um, making sense haul. And let me know in the comments um, if you guys have melted uh, birdies or have birdies in your collection. Um, uh, I would love to hear your thoughts or, or what are some other really good blends that Birdie has, has out there that I don't know of. I would love to know that as well, too, because yes. So I figured this is a good start for me with Birdie's. And I have a few in, in my D stash as well that I'm going to eventually go over to. Um, yes. So, all right. Excuse me. My allergies are really bad right now. Uh, I just want to say thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you all have a wonderful day or night or both. And I hope to see you all in the next one. Take care.